Okay, this is Professor Guest, and we're going to discuss, uh, I'm going to go over some of the hints that I posted in the announcement for identifying sedimentary rocks. Um, the first thing we talk about is dropping a little bit of acid on certain rocks to see if they fizz for help with identification. And rock number 39 and 40 will both fizz if you drop a little bit of acid on them. Another thing that you want to notice is the pattern of indentations that my rock shows and these were made by fossils. So that is the difference between what the fossils look like as opposed to just other sedimentary clasts. So those are two things to keep in mind. Another thing is looking at grain size. The two rocks on the left are very fine grain and the rock on the right is coarse grain. Let's see, what else? Okay, and then some rocks have layers and that's called, um, in this case it's, it's fissile. And if you look very closely you can see very thin layers as opposed to something like this rock which has no layers at all. Another thing to keep in mind is the texture. This rock, even though my sample is a little beat up, um, it has sugary texture and that is a, a chief identification um, mark of this type of rock as opposed to this rock here does not have the sugary texture. So those are a few things I wanted to go over with. I hope this helps. Good luck with your sedimentary lab. Take care and have a great week. Bye-bye.